what is going on YouTube it's a boy Billy Kibaki and today I'm going to show you how to install PKGJ on your PS Vita or your PS TV so what this does is that it helps you to download PS Vita games DLC and also PS1 games to your Vita console so let's go ahead and get started so head over to the links in the description and you want to download three files you want to download the non pdrm and also you want to download the pk the pkgj you can use version 19 or version 20 but i i'm going to use version 19 and also you want to download this config text after you've downloaded all those find them on your pc and we will need to transfer these over to the vita so go to my killer shell and then press select and right here we want to go ahead and connect the Vita using FTP so I'm going to use FileZilla and that IP address that you see up top right there that's the IP address you need to type into FileZilla but if you already connect to it in the past you can just click this down arrow and you can see the previous IP address and that's it we're connected so on your UXO right here go inside that and then what you want to do is create a new directory and we're gonna call this one PKGI and here it is now go in it and let's drag this config text in it now go back up and what we're gonna do next is that we're gonna go to the tie folder and we're gonna drag the non PDRM sprigs over in it perfect now go back up and what we need to do final is drag the PKGJ over right here and that's it here it is so on the Vita press circle and then go all the way down to your t to your UXO let me see if I can focus some more okay now go down to your tie folder right here and you'll see this config text so go down to the config text press X okay now go down to kernel and press the right button on the on the d-pad so you want to press right on the d-pad it's going to create a new line so go down press X and we need type in the spricks in this line so you want to type U x0 colon tie non pdrm and you want to press full stop s k p r x and that's it now you're going to see this down arrow down here so press it perfect press circle press x to save it okay now press circle to go back out now go all the way down and there is the PKGJ let me focus this again there it is so press X press X again X to continue let it install okay perfect now every time you enter a new Sprix are a new plugin you need to restart the console for it to take effect so press start go down to reboot and reboot the console okay now go all the way down and you will see the PKGJ folder um, icon so go ahead and launch it And as you can see it re it refreshes and it found a ton of games so you can hit triangle and you can go down to 
refresh games refresh updates refresh dlc or refresh psx so if you go to ps x and hit refresh it's going to refresh and show you a bunch of ps1 games or if you go back to triangle and hit refresh games it will show you a bunch of vita games so let me just search for a very small game to try it out and show you guys okay so this is the game i'm gonna press x and you will see it start to download down at the bottom okay so it's done so when it's finished downloading you can just hit the ps button close the icon and there you go now we have the new game icon right there so let's just launch it and show you guys and that's it it's working very well so that's how you install it guys very simple and very easy so if anyone found this video helpful to them please leave a like and also share the video and you can also subscribe for more videos if you want so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in my next video